Fred picked me up from the airport when I arrived from Australia to join Somerset. And there was big Fred Heathrow. And I remember we went via Henley. We had lunch at Henley. The flight must have been a bit later in the day than normal. It wouldn't have mattered. Maybe it was breakfast. Fred, <laughs> Fred would have been hungry whatever time of the day it was. And then we drove from Henley down to Bristol because the chairman of Somerset County Cricket Club at that stage was a fellow called Bunty Longrig. Well, Bunty lived up at Clifton in one of those beautiful old stone homes up there. We stopped off there and then we got to Taunton on the Thursday before Good Friday. And I was introduced to Roy Kerslake, who was the captain of the club. But Fred was my driver all the way to, uh, to Taunton. Yeah, so we had a lovely chat with Fred and, you know, we remained uh, you know, friends because that, that 68 was his last year. And I reckon the only outfield catch I ever dropped was off Fred's bowling at Taunton one day. A big sky from Bob Barber from Warwickshire when I was at mid-off. Bob was either pulling or trying to loft one away on the leg side, got a leading edge and it went very high, only just past the stumps at the bowler's end. I was at mid-off. And I called for it. Fred could have easily caught it. I called for it. And it just wait, I had to wait for so long. I dropped the catch and uh, was mortified because I should have caught it in my sleep. I think I might have got the teapot from Fred. Stood glaring, glaring at me because he could have caught it himself quite easily. 